Hot, 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 hot. There we go. Ah, Jesus. Hot. Good morning, good morning, good morning. It's Mike here. Hope you're having a great day or night. 112 degrees here with humidity that's like 27%. I can barely breathe, people. <laughs> anyway, got orders to package up from the weekend. Got to run to the post office. I don't think I'll be going anywhere today because it's just it's just too hot. So I'll be focusing on stuff listing in the house. Uh, hopefully in the cool air conditioning. I don't want to go in my garage and deal with the lights and that heat in there. Hopefully we get some rain today. It's in the forecast. That'd be nice. Hopefully it cools it off. So let's see what we do today. All right, let's dive into what I sold in the past couple days. First is from Amazon here. This is a DVD uh, Nomads from 2002, disc only. Came out of that Goodwill lot that I picked up some time back. This sold for $10.60 plus $3.99 for a total of $14.59 shipped. On to Etsy. We got here a BG Spirits Having Flown Vinyl LP Record. Came out of those record haul lots. This sold for $4 plus $4 shipping for a total of $8 shipped. This also came out of that record haul lot, and it's another vinyl record here. Waylon Jennings, Turn the Page, Vinyl LP. Sold for $8 plus $4 shipping for a total of $12 shipped on Etsy. On to good old eBay. These two next items both went to the same buyer. What we have here is a 1990s Phoenix Suns NBA Basketball Purple Charles Barkley Vintage Shirt Size Large. Same buyer also purchased this 90s Lee Sport Phoenix Suns Big Logo Black Charles Barkley Vintage Shirt Size Extra Large. Both these went to auction. They both went for $4.99 plus $4 shipping for a grand total of $17.98 shipped. Both shirts going to California. Long Beach! Next item I paid $1 for at the thrift shop. Had on eBay for about 35 days, and then um, they had a big stain on the back. So I'm like, you know what? Just, let's relist it. And we threw it to auction. We have a 2005 Sturgis Motorcycle Rally denim sleeveless button front jean shirt, size 2XL. Sold for $5.50 plus $4 shipping for a total of $9.50. Going to Dumont, New Jersey. Paid a dollar for this and literally sat on eBay for over a year. Decided, you know what, I got to get rid of this stuff. It's just piling up. It's sitting on eBay. It's going dormant. It's never getting any views, never getting any watches. So we're just, we th I threw a lot of stuff to auction that ended on Sunday. Here we have a 2007 Goo Goo Dolls Let Love in Concert Tour Dates t-shirt, size small. Sold on auction for $2.99 plus $4 shipping for a total of $6.99 shipped. Here's another one of those uh, same similar type items that sat on eBay for over a year. Paid a dollar for this Brooks and Dunn Play Something Country Concert Tour Dates t-shirt size large. This sold for $3.99 plus $4 shipping for a total of $7.99. Uh, the buyer is overseas, so uh, they paid a total of $21.65. Paid $3.99 at the bid with $17.66 shipping and handling. And uh, went to Erlanger, Kentucky. Here's another rag I paid a dollar for at the thrift shop. Sat on eBay for over a year. We have a Western Illinois University Red 5050 Russell USA Vintage Retro T-shirt. Size medium. Went on auction, sold for $4.25 plus $4 shipping for a total of $8.25 shipped. Picked this up at it locally for about a dollar. It was in a big video game lot. We have a Super Nintendo Super Star Wars video game tested and works. It was on sale and sold for $8.76 shipped. Paid 50 cents for this at a garage sale. We have a Bazaar The Trading Game 1967 3M bookshelf vintage board game complete. This also was on sale as well on the eBay store. Sold for $27.96 shipped. Found this in a box in the garage. I had it for a while and just overlooked it for some reason. Uh, listed it, sold within seven days. It's a Kenneth Cole Reaction Men's Slim Fit Wrinkle Free Sundew Dress Shirt, size 15 and a half, 36, 37. Paid $3 for this at Burlington Coat Factory. Ended up selling for $15.16 on sale. Shipped. This came out of a storage unit. Literally have pennies into this clothing. It's an Air Apostle New York bright green cotton full zip hoodie sweatshirt size medium. Threw it to auction originally. Nobody, no takers. Had one watcher. Relisted again. Had about six watchers. But only got one bid. $2.99 plus $7 shipping for a total of $9.99 shipped 
Here we have another trash to cash story. This came out of a storage unit. It's a Banana Republic Beige Crochet Flowers Cardigan Bolero. Kim, Bolero. Yep, she says. Sweater jacket, medium. Again, this uh, went on auction for seven days, no takers. Nobody was even looking at this. It was, they were just overlooking it, man. That's what was going on. Relisted again, and somebody went out there, purchased it for $2.99 plus $7 shipping for a total of $9.99 shipped. Steve and I picked this up at the storage auction. Manager's special. It was just sitting there. I showed it in a video weeks ago and paid a dollar for it. It's a Super Nintendo Battletoads in Battle Maniacs video game tested and works. It was on sale and ended up selling for $25.16 shipped. A whopping dollar on some of those clothing guys. That was the take home pay. <laughs> I, I gotta start looking around to see if maybe White Castle is hiring or something, man, because uh, things are getting tough. There's no doubt about it. You know, I, I don't know if it's just all of you guys out there just selling everything else cheaper, or maybe you're picking better. I don't know. Obviously, I'm joking, but no, some of these items I literally made a dollar, two dollars profit on. Um, again, just trying to get rid of them. That's the whole point here is uh, they're sitting up, taking space, and at some point here, I'm going to snap, and I'm just going to just take a truckload over to Salvation Army or something and say, here, take it all, because uh, I need to start focusing on some bigger and better things. Moving on to what sold on Steve's, eBay's. Showed you guys this item some weeks back. It's a Lucky Brand Sawtooth Pearl Snap White Floral Western Short Sleeve Casual Shirt Size Medium. Just another rag. Paid a dollar or two for this thrift shop. Sold for $12 of free shipping. This came out of a liquidation lot. We paid five bucks a piece for these, so $20 total. Uh, it was a lot of four Tree Gator Original 20 Gallon Watering Bags Slow Tree Irrigation, and these sold for $80 shipped. This was also a liquidation, I believe liquidation.com buy that's sold on Steve's eBay. It's a Leviton DSE 06-10ZZ Decor Electronic Low Voltage LED and CFL Rocker Slide Dimmer. Jesus! Sold for $22 plus $8 shipping for a total of $30 shipped. I gotta say, that's, that is work reading off that, doing voiceovers to those pictures. It's boring sometimes. Just being honest. Now it's time for Kim's Grammar Corner. Kim, how do you spell grammar? Hi everybody, today I'm gonna to talk to you about two words that people confuse all the time. The first one is ax. This is a device used to cut wood. Normally it has a wooden handle and a metal sharp point. This is the word ask. See the question mark? You have never axed anybody unless you're committing murder or admitting to dismembering somebody. You have asked them something. Don't ask, ask. Sales are slow, guys. Do me a favor, throw some of the stuff to auction. This stuff's been sitting in your eBay store for a while. If you have some of the desirable stuff, you know, as you can see on the screen here, Plano Columbia men's hiking shirt that I showed in a video. Look, 12 watchers. It's already got Action Jackson on it. And then we also have a Vineyard Vines that's at the, on the auction block at the moment with 11 watchers. So, uh, if you're just not getting the views, doing the buy it now, best offer stuff with eBay, whether it's clothing or any other items out there, and you literally have dollars in this stuff, you know, dump it. Dump it out there. Throw it out there. You don't want to do it for a loss, but at the same point in time, maybe you double your money, triple your money, and, you know, you're hoping that stuff gets bid up. And um, this, this will do a lot of different things for you. It'll drive eyes to your listings, eyes to your other items, and should get your eBay store afloat. So just some advice that's worked for me, guys. Um, always, especially in the summertime, summer sales for me are always slow. But uh, if you got some desirable stuff, don't be afraid to just toss it out there and see what happens. So thanks for watching today's video, guys. It's a warm one out here today. Waiting for the rain. Not sure it's going to happen. If you did like today's video, if you did like Kim's, what is it called, Kim? Grammar Corner. Grammar Corner. Give it a thumbs up. Till next time I'm out of here. Peace. Vlog. Oh.